got the news. Weaponized angels. We have to all prepare for this angel, these angels that are coming down. These angels are carrying weapons. These angels will destroy you in a second if you have iniquity on you. These angels are not playing whatsoever. So we have all different types of angels. We have the angels that are recording our deeds. And then we have a guardian angel that guards our soul. We have angels that come down as messengers. But today we're going to focus on the weaponized angels because we are in the end time. And they are on their way. Again, we are in the end time. And these are the ones that's coming. And when they bump into the man and the woman of sin, they will snap your body, your neck. They will snap your back in half. They will cut you to shreds. They will burn you. They will burn you right then. They'll set your body ablaze. Let's get into it. We're going to start with Psalms 104, number 4. Who maketh his angel spirits and his ministers a flaming fire? Exodus 3, 2. And the angels of the Lord appeared unto him in a flame of fire out of the midst of a bush. And he looked and behold, the bush burned with fire. Exodus 23, 20. Behold, I sent an angel before you to keep thee in the way. This is a strict angel. If you have sin and iniquity on you in any type of way, stand to the rear when this happens and do not touch provoke say anything make any light conversation with this angel right here because this angel is here to keep thee in the way of the lord and these angels are strict and severe and to bring thee into the place which i have prepared it tells you it warns you beware of him and obey his voice provoke him not for he will not pardon your transgression for my name is in him what do you mean he won't pardon your transgression? The moment he know that you are a sinner, he is going to fuck you up. Stand down and stand back with this one. Second Samuel 24, 16. And when the angel stretched out his hand upon Jerusalem to destroy it. What do you mean? These angels, one angel can destroy the whole city. A large enough angel could flip the earth. It only needs, God only needs one angel. Right? The angels is going to help throw your ass in hell. Second Kings 19.35 And it came to pass that night that the angel of the Lord went out and smote. What do you mean smote? He, he went out and destroyed the people. That's smote. In the camp of the Assyrians. And hundred and four and 5,000, right? A whole army, one angel did. And when they arose early in the morning, behold, they were all dead. First Chronicles 21, 12, three days of the sword of the Lord, even the pestilence in the land and the angel of the Lord destroying throughout all the coast of Israel. He did what? One angel destroyed all the coast of Israel. First Chronicles 21, 27. And the Lord commanded the angel, and he put up his sword again into the sheaf thereof. After he did what? Destroyed. So the angels are coming to do what? Punish the wicked. So it's a lot of people having dreams that these angels is coming down with weapons in their hands. And when they get to people, they are breaking their necks and they're breaking their backs and they're cutting them in half and they're showing them no mercy. The angels are chasing them. They're running into stores and everything else trying to hide from what's coming. And they are accurate because that is getting ready to happen. We need to get out of the infiltrated teaching that the angels are some kind of soft fairy. These damn pagans, like I said, they infiltrated the Torah. They infiltrated the Bible and they infiltrated our God. They try to make your God weak and of no effect. They try to make the people of Israel weak and of no effect. 
and then they did the same thing to our angels try to make them females and when they paint the angels they make all the angels females just like they do the black man today they want to paint him in a dress and make him soft why because that's what they is so like I said we are reaching a period of time right now that uh, these angels is coming down and I said you know and I don't know where I got it from but it, it's, it's some I got it from somewhere Woe to the man with iniquity on his back. Let's wrap the news.